This is Jeff with Shout Out Minnesota, and we are here with Jackie Motherfucking Chain up in this bitch. School the city. New Age tattoo artist. All right, we're here in Moorhead, Minnesota tonight, and uh, Yon Tour. So let's talk a little bit about that. Man, it's been crazy, man. This is uh, actually tomorrow's our last show. Our, our our tour ends in Kansas City, but it's been a good, it's been a good trip, man. Like. Tonight was Moorhead. They showed love, man. I love it down here, man. You know, it's 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 been a great adventure, man. Like this is my artist Scoo Versetti. It's his first tour. You know, I've been on I've been on a bunch of shits, but it's his first tour, so it was really special to me, man. Because it's an opportunity I had to take my artist out on the road with me, you know. So we just been enjoying it, man, trying to get it in. Let's talk a little bit about uh, your history, how you got uh, started in the music industry. Uh, let's tell a little bit about that. Uh, you know, like back in uh, back in 08, 09, man, I had a, I had a joint called Rollin'. Um, it featured uh, Kid Cudi, Big Sean jumped on the remix. Uh, I got signed to Universal Records off of it. And uh, it was a big underground hit, man. And, 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 you know, I've been dropping records since then, just kind of keeping it pushing, man. And, and uh, you know, there's a few underground artists like I, I consider myself a real underground artist like you know like even though I've, I've had a, a little bit of mainstream success and I, I, I'm i known in the main like I'm underground like I'm we still on the chilling circuit we out here getting it fucking with the fans you know real shit you know I love it alright uh, what kind of new projects you got going on um, I got my new joint coming out uh, the Bruce Lee Chronicles 3 you know it's got a bunch of features man I got Scoob on there I got Assassin both of my artists man I got Riff Raff Bun B Chevy Woods Ritz like it's really too many to name like it's it's a good complete project man if you've if you've heard Bruce Lee 1 and Bruce Lee 2 then you know what to expect if you haven't then go check them shits out and you know Bruce Lee 3 is going to be a good ass project man and uh, I got an album dropping with uh my homeboy Steven Smith is sort of like a live, live music album. So, you know, it's going to be a good year for us. My boy got his project dropping this year. Assassin got his project dropping this year. Pleasure House. You know, we got we got a good year coming up, man. You'll be hearing from us. All right, let's talk about you. Let's, what we got going on? Um, pretty much like Jackie said, this is my first tour, so this is my first run. Um, it's been fun. It's just been crazy. Um, Seen a lot of shit I ain't never seen, you know, did a lot of shit I ain't never done. Um, far as what I got coming up, um, my new project is about to drop, probably here in the next couple of days, hosted by uh, DJ Frank White from Hood Rich. Um, name of it is uh, Go For Broke Part 1, the miniseries. The first single. Y'all gonna go crazy over this. Bitches on my dick. It's B-O-M-D. Scoo it's Scoo Versetti for featuring Jaron Benton and me. Crazy single, man. We're trying to shoot the video down at South by right now. We're working out the details. Yeah, produced by uh, G Money. Yeah. It's crazy. Stupid it's, single, it's, man. It's crazy. Um, the project pretty much is produced by my little brother, G Money, uh, with a couple features on there from Trumpets here and Calico Keys. Uh, it, it's a dope project. Like I said, it's a hood rich hosting my project. It's, it's a good pleasure house project. If you've ever heard of my music before, check me out, the fans of mine, then you know it's going to be something dope. I do my thing. Um, if you're not and you're curious to see what I'm going to do before it drop, just go to Live Mixtapes, type in Scoob Versetti, S-C-O-O-B-V-E-R-C-E-T-T-I. -E 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 I'll pop up. My first mixtape is called Self-Inflicted Game. Check that shit out and it's jamming, man. There you fuck go. with me. There you go. Got all the info coming up. Uh, Jackie, so uh, we cut the verse here tonight. Uh, we're in the Ice House Studios. Ice House Studios. Shout out to Shout Ice out, House man. Studio. Shout out to Red Knight for letting us come through and do our damn thing. All right. Uh, also, uh, one unique thing uh, that I have actually never seen is having your own tattoo artist on well, tour yeah, with you. Know, you. We, you know, we so, stay inked up, man. You know, we stay inked up, man. And like, you know, like a lot of rappers, they bring their DJ or they hype, man, or. But like me, man, like this this ain't just my tattoo artist, it's my homie. You know what I'm saying? This my dog, man. He's on he's been on the Ink Life tour, man. He's one of the top one hundred tattoo artists, not in the nation, in the world. You know what I'm saying? So I bring him on the road with me, he inks me up, you know what I'm saying? And and that's what it is. Like, you know, we try to get him work, but it ain't about that. It's just about it's we homies, you know what I'm saying? So okay. I, I go on the road with people I fuck with, man. I don't 
I don't want to go on the road with someone that I'm going to have to worry about this and that. Like, I go on the road with people I fuck with, you know what I'm saying? My artists, my tattoo artists. Like, we family, Pleasure House, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, anytime you see Jackie Chan and you need that real ink and want something that's like, you're not going to have to be embarrassed about it three years, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, get some real shit, man. It's worth the extra dollar. That's why I bring them on the, tour, on the road with me because I'm like, you know... I can't lie, you know, in this day and age, tattoos and rap and, and, and sports. And, you know, I remember like 10 years ago, it was crazy if someone in the NBA had one or two tattoos. Allen Iverson was crazy because he had all the... But now it's like if someone don't have a tattoo, it's weird. You know what I'm saying? It's the cultures, hip-hop, tattoo, music. You know what I'm saying? All that shit's intertwined. So, like, I just want... Just like I want to bring you the best music I can give you. I want to bring you the best tattoos I can give you because I see some fucked up tattoos on the road. Like y'all got we some. We get offered. Yeah, I got some tattoos. fucked up shit. So man, <laughs> new age tattoos. Like I bring them on the road. He tattoos my fans. They don't only. They don't only remember. Okay, and the Jackie Chan show was dope. Now they're like, man, I got the Jackie Chan show was dope, and I got this dope ass tattoo. You know what I'm saying? By one of the top tattoo artists in the world. Like, you know what I'm saying? It it's not like I'm bringing some Rudy Poot on the road with me. Like we all. We are yeah. the best in our field, what we do, you know what I'm so, saying? Yeah, but when you get with them, if you do catch New Age, if you're lucky enough to get some ink from this dude, man, come correct. Don't come with that, I got $40, I got $50. Come out your pocket, because if you want some work that's going to last, no no lie. The boy shit is so official. He did a portrait of my cousin who passed away. I put it on Facebook and tried to tag my cousin. He did a face recognition and tagged him for me in there. Wow. That shit was wow. that official, no lie, hand to God. The nice. boy that official. So if you want some official shit, break the bread. Break and, the and, bread. And I could sit here and name all the famous people he's tattooed. I really could because I'm, I'm not famous. I'm not famous. I could sit here and name all the A-listers and top, but I ain't going to do that because you're going on the strength of Jackie Chan face. I'm telling y'all. I ain't got to tell you he tattooed Marilyn Manson and, and all these other big motherfuckers. Like, I ain't got to say that because I'm, I'm letting you know he good. He, he, he got me... Right, he got my boy screwed yeah. right. Honestly, so. man. So let's start. That's that's what I was gonna say. Hey, man. Yeah, I'm new age. Uh, I make life tour all that stuff. Uh, but honestly, man, like Jackie got a hold of me. We've been talking for a little while. Like I've been listening to Jackie for years, at least like six, seven years. And uh, so like, yeah, I, I jumped at the chance. Like, yeah, dude. Like, I'll definitely come out with you. And um, it's definitely what you think it is. I mean, like everything fucking. Jackie's about like that's real life man he's he's a real deal and uh, Pleasure House is like coming up man you guys definitely gotta check out some of their artists like Scoob like impressed me so much like I'm around artists all the time but I definitely feel impressed and like they showed me mad love and uh, I definitely am grateful and appreciate it you know it's but, a good, good network good network with with, with artists and in, in the, the label yeah, and all yeah, that yeah definitely and, like nowadays man like I mean any major artist you look at is, is definitely inked up you know yeah. I mean it, it's it's definitely a mainstream thing so you know, being, being one of the top in my field like I definitely uh, I get to I get to mingle with a couple people that like, you know I never would have got to right you know? I mean I'm a fan of this guy like no, he didn't I, have I to see. come on the road with me, man. He didn't have to come on the road with me, man. Like, when I asked him, man, it was like, finish out these dates with me, dog. You know what I'm saying? Let's get on the road. Let's do it. And that's what it is. You know, we're going to South by Southwest this year, man. You know, uh, I got a show coming up May 14th in Minneapolis, St. Paul. All my Hmong homies, come fuck with me. You know, I got y'all, man. Asian pride till I die. You know what I'm saying? Anybody, white, black. It don't matter. We put on a good show, man. And Minneapolis, we're going to show out. I promise you. St. Paul, we finna show out. We finna eat some Juicy Lucy's and come to the show and <laughs> fuck shit up, man. There it Guaranteed. is. May 14th. You heard it. He's coming back. Uh, Twin Cities area. We're going to gonna get that show promoted. Uh, Jackie's showing love to Minnesota. We're going to show some love to him. So Hey, shout out to shout out. Like, man, this, this dude shout drove, out the shout out. He drove, like, yeah, he drove yeah. like three hours yeah, to come see me, man. I fuck with y'all, man. Like, you already know, I fuck with y'all the long way, man. Like, when you come out to see me, it's guaranteed you're going to get your money's worth, man. Like, we get it in, man. We party. Never stay sober, man. We're going to get it in. Guaranteed. Real talk. All right. This nigga just got his clumsy ass. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
tripping. Trying to interview. I was yeah. just trying to get out. My it's bed. the bag boy. He all right, though. Yeah. Right. <laughs> it's not who you're going through with the bread. It's all good. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So before we go, before we go here, let's let's give a, a, a uh, actually let, let's talk about social media wise. How you, how fans can get a hold of you on social media. Uh, That's a big thing. Instagram Jackie underscore chain like a chain you wear. C H A I N. Twitter is Jackie Chain, C H A I N, 7 4. Um, and that's what's up. Just fuck with me. Tell Scoop. me shit, Scoop. With me, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter is the same thing. Scoop Vicetti. S C O O B, B as in Victor, E R C E T T I. And uh, fuck with me on the gram. I love the gram. Hit me on the gram, goddamn. Do it for the gram. Hashtag Vercetti Ho. All right, put it on there. Hey man, you can check out my work at uh, on Instagram. It's probably it's uh, new age tat t a t two. That's it, man. The number two. It's number two. Number two. Number two. Pleasure All right. house, man. Pleasure, Pleasure house. house Pleasure house in this bitch. All right, one last shout out. One last shout out to Minnesota. Shout out Minnesota. Minnesota. What's up, Minnesota? We eat cheese curds like a motherfucker out here. Yeah, yeah. Minnesota got much love. Shout out to shout out. Do it.